welcome back to another abandoned adventure. You can't see too much where I am right now. The building behind me is a, it's a little guest hotel. Where I am, I'm at an abandoned Massachusetts ski resort. Yep, Massachusetts, not New York. This was an accidental find on the way coming back from somewhere else. So of course I had to pull in. But we're gonna investigate it together. So let's come and check out some of these buildings. I did notice a ski lift. There's a few buildings on the property and uh, the details will down, be down below as always. Uh, I'm not too sure of what was going on here when it closed, folks, when it closed or anything like that. So we're gonna discover it together. And obviously when I say we, I mean you and me. So let's get to exploring. Look at this. This is just one of the buildings here. This was uh, actually an accidental find on the way back from somewhere else. Let's check it out. Okay, so that would have been your setup where the phone and the lamp is. It's like a little hotel. Little courtesy coffee maker right there on the wall. Don't think I've ever seen anything like that. As here's a view of where I am. There's uh, another building up there and there's some buildings up there. There's a ski lift. There's a couple of them actually, so we're gonna actually check those out. Let's see what's in this room over here. Oh, double beds. What's this? The Bible. I believe this is probably the bathroom. Yep. Stand up shower. It's pretty small. All right, so that's the first building you come to, which is like a, it's really not that big. It's a few rooms of uh, beds. I didn't go downstairs actually, I should have, but um, there's a ski lift over there and there's another one up there. All right, let's check out this building right here. There's a few buildings on this property and we're gonna check them out together. I wonder if this is like another hotel or all right, I'm just guessing at this point. You know, why don't we just go in and find out what it really is? Hey, take a seat. Okay. Let's see what's on the ground. Oh, oh, all right. So look at that. Wow, way cool. So this is where you would jump on your ski lift. You'd sit here. And this mechanism right here would spin you around and bring you up the mountain. Check that out. Way cool. Now, I've never gone skiing before. I've always kind of been like, I'm not going to go down a mountain on sticks. But uh, for those of you that ski, I, uh, I got to give you credit. <laughs> All right. So this is what's going on inside here. And there's the ski lift way cool there's the pulley system that operated this really cool it's kind of on the idea of like a sky lift ride and the control panel is in this office right here let's see Now I'll have all the information down below as always. I'm kind of doing this blind. I did look up, look it up. So basically I just know the name of this place and here's all the workings. Whoa, the interlock switches, counterweight, number two, not used. So this is everything that would operate the lift chairs to bring you up to the mountain. Pretty cool. Oh, the towers. All right. 
Whoa. A wreck. All right. A lot of stuff left around in this little area. Look at that. This old furniture just kind of has that 70s vibe going on. And again, it's Christmas, as always. Look at this, guys. I don't know if you can see this, but see that little light on right here? There's actually, there's still power here. And this place has been closed down for like a ton of years. <laughs> Well, at least since like the late 90s, early 2000s. It's crazy. As you all know, I paint rocks. Hey, little lady, I'm gonna leave you right here. So if anybody finds this, it's a gift to you. I'm gonna leave you right there on the chair. Let's go see what we can see upstairs. I did see an upstairs to this place, so let's see. Okay, stairs. Please hold me. All right. They seem pretty sturdy, but you just never know. I mean, really, you just never know. Okay, what's up here? What's up here? I wonder if there's rooms up here. Oh, wow, it's like an apartment. I just got a peek in the window. Oh, boy, that boy just moved. Oh boy. All right. So this has like a little hotel, motel type of feel, but we are not at the Holiday Inn. <laughs> oh man, I'm like slow stepping it here. Okay. Hello. Hey, look, there's even Christmas lights hanging on the window. Whew. All right, so here is your kitchen. I, I guess this is the main chalet, maybe? Not too sure. Pretty cool light. Oh, that scared the crap out of me. All right. Ooh, there's still food here. Look at that. You think that mayonnaise is still good? Should I try it? I'm kidding. Some medic oh, oh, wow, there's still some pills in here. See, what does it say? Rus Rusperidone? Rusperidone. Not quite sure what that's for. There's that. It's like a, it's an apartment. Okay. Bra, underwear. Jesus. Hey. Oh, I think someone may have been staying here after the fact because there's some sort of a blow up mattress here. What's this? Nasal cavity. Okay, maybe this is like something that if somebody was going to school, this is uh, this is their stuff. Okay, undergarments and stuff. God, it feels really kind of strange going through people's stuff, but I mean, this is abandoned. No one's here. So, wow, what's back here? Happy holidays. Whoa, another bed. Oh, jeez. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I'm caught up in the. I'm caught up in the cord in the shade here. All right. Is that a light on? Hello? Does that look like the light's on? Hello? Is that light on or is it just like a skylight? not on, but the power's on, whoa. I 
Can't tell if someone's squatting here. Let's save some electricity. We'll shut that off. I can't shut it off. Oh, jeez. Hello. <laughs> no need to have the light going 24 hours a day. Wow, I wonder if someone's squatting here. No clue. All right, let's see more of this resort. What is that? Is there some paperwork? So whoever was staying here was obviously studying psychology. There's a lot of, you know, learning materials from schools, from a school rather. There's their sneakers. Look at this. What's back here? Wow. I mean, there's all kinds of food and everything still left behind. There's popcorn, microwave. God, doesn't it just amaze you? Like all the stuff that's left behind, it, it always does for me. Okay, the bathroom. We've all seen enough bathrooms on the Explore, so I'm not even gonna go there. I like that light though, it is pretty cool. So all right, this is that building. This is that second building, and this is right above the chairlift. That's where I came in down there. Kind of hiding my car around the, around the corner. All right, oh, look at that building over there. Let's check that out. This is big time tick country. If you're gonna do these type of explores, I suggest you jump in a big barrel of bug spray. I've already picked a tick off me and I've only been here for like all of 10 minutes. Oh, so I'm glad they have that. It's a big gaping hole in the ground. Let's see what's up here. There's a few more buildings over here. I'm gonna go up and around this way. Oh, look at that. There's another building right there. What does that say? It says the children's center. All right, let's go see that. Wow, way cool. So here's another building that I was showing. I was gonna go up and around to get up there, but I couldn't really find access. It was too woodsy, but this isn't really that much better, but you know, it's a lesser of two evils. So I'm gonna go this way. Here's the children's center. Let's check this building. This place is actually a lot bigger than I had imagined. I thought there was only a couple buildings here. There's all kinds of buildings here. Look at this. There's a ski lift right there. Basically that goes down into that other place that I showed you where the chair was and it brings you up the mountain and there's other stuff to see but right now I want to check out this children's center what do you think we should do go downstairs first or just go up the stairs I don't know let's go through the garage that makes sense we are greeted by a lot of floaties I can actually hear water off in the distance so look at that Summer, summer, summertime. Wow. Look at this. <gasps> Whoa. Look at that. Look at that ski mobile. Is that a ski mobile? Looks really long. It's a Puma. Right. I don't know if I should stand on that. It's a fast track Arctic, Arctic cat. Okay. This amazes me. These things just get left behind. This would be fun tooling around in the snow. Hell yeah. Look at that. Way cool. Really cool. You just really never know what you're going to find in any of these buildings. All right, so when I see all these floats right here, it leads me to believe that there's probably some sort of like a lazy river type of a situation where you could sit in these and 
just kind of glide down the, the river. Work it cool. Really cool. Let's see what else is in this little shop area before we go upstairs. This is the children's center. God. Oh, okay. All right. More floats. Little tool area. K tube. Pretty sweet. It's down here. A flood. All right. All right. So that was the bottom area of the children's center. So let's we'll go up and uh, see what's upstairs. Probably arts and crafts, maybe things to keep the kids busy. I'm guessing that type of a thing. But let's find out. I'm really surprised something like this. Ow. <laughs> Wouldn't. Look at these stairs. They're all like crooked. But uh, wouldn't stay in business. I mean, it seems like they had every amenity. Oh, 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 oh man. Okay. So this is inside the children's center. All right, let me get up around in here. Can I do this? I really don't want to go through the window. How safe is this? How safe is this? Oh, jeez. Please hold me, please hold me. Oh, please hold me. Whew. All right. Here's a door here. Whoa. Whew. All right. Wow, it's kind of nice in here. Look at this. Look at the view. All right. Nothing in the freezer, nothing in the fridge. Even though it's pretty well ventilated, I do smell a little bit of mold. I mean, that's what the carpet, it's gonna hold some moisture, so. All right, let's see what's over here. Wow. Oh, I see a waterfall back there. You could probably hear it. it smells moldy, what's this? All right, just all kinds of, uh, Stickers, welcome to your national forest. Everybody pictures of people skiing. Look at cool. All right, Ooh, look at all that mold. All right, bathrooms. And it looks like this door just basically brings you back out to where I came in. So I'm gonna turn around and go out here. Wow, look at this waterfall. Actually, there's no stairs. Oh, shoot, and this door's locked. All right, let me go out the other side. Way cool. Is there a staircase here? Maybe I can get out over here. Oh yeah, I, the whole thing is collapsed. I can't get out that way. I wanna get to that waterfall. All right, look at that. There's a sign right there. Ski we level one. All right. Let's continue on. So I'm trying to look up a little bit of information here and there in between filming. Um, from what I read, this was the largest ski resort that did night skiing. So that's pretty cool. Not exactly sure of the year it closed, but uh, please feel free to look in the description. Or, you know, I'll add some kind of information as I'm going along. All right. I gotta go back down the stairs. I'll just see you when I get down there. Damn. Now, there's another building right up there, and I believe there's some up in the distance, but to get over there, I'm just going to go back down here. Whoa! I'm going to get on this way and around the corner instead of having to walk through the entire field. So I'll see you in a minute. All right, and I'm back. 
so here's another building and from what i've seen from the pictures this might be the main uh, i don't know ski lodge or um is that what they call it a ski lodge so. all right so this is the old canteen so that's about right that's where they had all the refreshments Woo! and that's where you would enjoy a meal what is this apples oh look an apple tree nice let's see what's in here is there stairs no all right maybe the stairs on the side all right there's sort of stairs we'll take the sort of stairs okay at this yeah i'd say this is the main chalet here's some skis right there this is probably where you would get your lift tickets maybe uh you'd sit you'd have your hot cocoa here you'd eat there's a fireplace right there how awesome is that i mean look at these light fixtures i mean that's pretty 70s you know what i mean 70s 80s it's pretty dated but it's also Pretty cool. Look at all these skis right here. Look at that. Wow, there's a ton of them. Dynastar. Pretty awesome. Hey. Look at this. I'm gonna show you that waterfall in a minute. I'm just kind of in awe at everything that's left behind. Look at all these skis. All right, here's the counter, probably where you would rent all your equipment. Or maybe actually this was food service back here. I'm gonna guess uh, maybe some food service. This place is pretty massive. Wow. All right, here's the kitchen. Here's the kitchen. Whoa. It's all kind of caving in. There's actually still some stuff left behind. This floor is literally caving in right there. There's a hole. So I think I'm just gonna go around the other side. I mean, I'm by myself, so I'm not looking to fall through any floors. And then I'll just be left here abandoned and you guys can just explore my dead body. All right, that's probably not funny. Okay. Let's go out this way. If not, then I'm just gonna go out that door out there because the waterfall's over there and there's a bridge. Looks like there's a bridge or something. Let's see what's out here. Saw some artwork hanging up on the wall over there. Bathrooms to the right. Who cares? Right. Look at this. Wow. All right, so I just came out of the main chalet or yeah, I guess that's what you call it. There's like ski boots all over the place. Skis. There's like a couple little buildings. Oh, wow, look at that. There's a bridge. I'm going to try and get over to the bridge. I hear a waterfall over here. This is so awesome. I literally got the whole place to myself. I always say that, like... Like, people are going to be, you know, I mean, people who explore, they get it. You know what I mean? It's like a score when you get to roam around somewhere. It's not like people are coming here. <laughs> but uh, this is so awesome. It turned out to be a, a good day. And, uh, whoa. All right, so here's another one of the 
mechanisms for the chairs, for the lift chairs right there. And here's a bridge. We're gonna walk across it. This would be the button that you hit to get on this. You would press this, I imagine. You get and you get your uh, your uh, your ski lift. Whoa! How awesome! It's a hot one, let me tell you. <laughs> Woo. So just continuing up the road here, I actually stopped at my car and grabbed some uh, AC. I'm literally dying. So I'm going at a snail's pace up here. And I think there's some more to see up here. So let's go check it out. <laughs> All right, so basically coming around almost to the top, I guess. I don't even know what this is. Maybe it's a hotel. It looks kind of like a hotel to me or it's apartments. Not quite sure, but uh, there's so much up here. It's, it's actually surprising me because just when you think it's like a couple little buildings, ba bam, a hotel left abandoned on top of the mountain. And what's over here? I imagine tennis courts that are way overgrown. Holy crap. Look at this. All right, this is, this is insane to me. Look at this. I mean, this is just like the explorer that just keeps on giving. Look at this. Yeah, this was like a mountaintop hotel over here. Wow. All right, so before I go upstairs, oh look, room 101, and this is open. Before I go upstairs and check it out, let's just check out a couple of these rooms down on the first floor. Look at this, no graffiti, I love it. It's just basically gutted, let me show you. It's almost set up apartment style. So I'm not sure if these were like luxury apartments or if this was a hotel just up the mountain from the ski resort. So while I was chilling in my car for a few minutes, trying to get some AC. I looked up uh, the last chairlift here. I think one of the last chairlifts was installed in 1968. One of the last double chair, oh, the bed's still here. And uh, the owner had passed away. And I guess the ski instructor also died in a terrible plane crash. He was only 27 years old. Um, the owner of this place, it was a very Irish theme from what I was reading. And every St. Patrick's Day, because they still had snow, they dyed the whole mountain green. So that must have been something to see. Imagine skiing down a green, snowy mountain. Wow. All right, so there's a couple of rooms here. Let's see what else we can find. I'm going to try and just make my way upstairs. Okay, here's the controls and the pump house. See if I can find a staircase up here. Oh, look at this. All right, so this one has shit. Oh, looks like a big old bird's nest. Look at that. Pretty cool. All right, well, I'm just going to peek upstairs because you never know. There could be some stuff left behind. I'm not going to show you every single room down here. You get the gist of what's happening. My sneak is squeaking. <laughs> All right, so we're heading upstairs. Whoa! No, we're not heading upstairs. There's no stairs right here. Jeez. All right, maybe uh, there's got a. What? All right. Can I? No, I can't do this. Look at me. I'm considering. No, I'm not even considering that. What do I think I am here? Indiana Jones? All right, let me go around the other side of the building and see if there's a staircase. 
not doing any anything too crazy. Okay. All right, that's more like it. So there's actual stairs now. I can't believe I was actually gonna consider climbing up the railing. Although that probably would have made for an interesting video, but would have been my last. All right, it's no railings. Should we go all the way up to the top or do you wanna see these? All right, we'll go all the way up to the top. So this is the top and uh, kind of looks like the same. I don't know guys, what do you think? I'll have to, I'll have to look and see if these were apartments or, or a hotel. It might be a hotel, I'm not sure. And this is the view. The, the resort is like way down there and believe it or not, once I get out of here. If I keep walking up this mountain, I think there's a casino up there. I might not know what I'm talking about, but I think there is. So we're gonna actually find out together. All right, there's really not too much to see. Do you wanna see any more of these rooms? Nah, all right. Okay, all right. I hear you, I hear you. All right, so I'm gonna pick this up once I get back onto the road. But this building is huge, and uh, it actually could be done over. I mean, it's nice. It's quiet. All right, I'll see you up there in a minute. Welcome to the Field of Dreams, a.k.a. Tick Country. Little reminder again, bug spray is your friend. And up the mountain, up the mountain we go. If it wasn't for this humidity, oh my god. All right, I'm gonna quit complaining. And this is the road. Look at this. It's like Crater City. How you all doing? You having a good day? Glad you could come along with me. This is actually more than I bargained for. And uh, that I, I, mean, I mean, I really, these accidental finds, you know, if, if you agree with me, let me know. If you don't, let me know. But uh, these accidental finds sometimes turn out to be better than the ones you look up or, you know, you find or you hear about. And uh, cause I don't really know a lot of the details. So it's pretty cool. See what else is up here. All right, so I'm a little further up the road. Pardon me being out of breath. It's just that it's hot, you know? I mean, I can handle the walk. It's just, it's so hot. I'm looking, there's something up here. There's something else up here. What? Oh. Okay, let's see what else is up here. All right, the road actually goes that way or this way. All right, so this is what's up the, uh, not just that, but it looks like a garage, probably for all the, the maintenance and the snow plows, I guess. I don't even know. And another, wow, looks like it's all on stilts. But another building right there. I'm gonna have to break out the drone and see what's around here, because it looks like there's a lot, and I'm, I'm sure I'm missing a lot, but there is a lot to see here. So let's go see what this is. All right, so let's go check out and see what is in this garage. Oh, it's a little cooler in here. Wow, let me turn my light on. Caution tape everywhere. Okay, so this is just like the garage area. Vending machine right here. Wish it was full right now. I'd grab something. <laughs> Whoa. Wow, this place is huge. Whoa. Little shop area. It's back here. Alright. Oh, obviously the penis guy was here. He's everywhere. 
One more. All your fittings, everything you'd need for the shop. Let's see if there's anything left in this file cabinet. Nothing. Let's go check out some of the shop. It's a big garage. Figured there'd be like some vehicles or something in here. Oh. There's a little upstairs up there. I'll check that out in a second. Oh. All right, let's just go up the, let's go up this. There's not too much in here, as you can see. It's a big garage. Let's go see what's, uh, up in the loft area. Okay, a lot of stuff up here. There's a vehicle service, a vehicle service board right up here. Look at that. Okay, these are the vehicles that they had here. calendar right here. September 2001. All right, as far as I know, this place shut down in the late 90s. And from what I know is because other area, oh, other mountaintop areas had more to offer and these places just declined. All right, I'm going to fall off the edge right there. So there's really not too much up here. A lot of service manuals for the books. I mean, for the, for the books. A lot of service manuals for the vehicles and stuff. Wow, really cool. There's just there's just so much here. Way, way cool. All right, let's go see what's in that other building. The building that's on stilts next door. I don't know why I thought there was a casino up here. I might have been reading the information wrong. Let's check out this vending machine. Are there any sodas left? No. Looks like someone already got to like the cash box and stuff. What is this? Oh, that's a tip strawberry melon. Okay. Yeah, this place. No sodas. Bummer. All right. All right, so this is that little building that's on stilts. Look at this, guys. This is like a race car. It's on its side. Let me see if I can turn that. It's missing all the tires, but it's something called a Wildcat. Not quite sure. If you know, let me know. Really cool. Looks like uh, there's the seat. It's pretty awesome. All right, so this is up beyond that little garage area and the little house or garage or whatever on stilts. And it looks like there's something up there in the woods. So we're just going to continue walking up and see what we find. It's too hot for this. Okay, really? <laughs> I just hiked all the way up here for this. So this is the, uh, the power station. I'm guessing it's not just for this area. I mean, it's, it's on, it's, it's running. So antennas may be active, lovely. But uh, all right, so here it is, power station. Exciting. I'm gonna continue on and see what else is around. So there's the backside of that either apartment buildings, condos, or it's a hotel. Um, I'm not quite sure, but if you really wanna know, I'll dig up the info and it'll be down below in the description. But look at that. Isn't that amazing? That just looks so beautiful against the mountain. 
<laughs> then there's this big old hike down the mountain. Today's not the day for this, but that is so cool. Wow. All right, so there's like the playroom and the children's center. And I don't know if you can see that, but whoa, way up there, like that's the actual where they came down and skied. You can see way up there, there's an actual lift that would bring you and drop you off up there and you would ski down the mountain. So behind this building, as you can see, are all the lifts to take you up the mountain right there. They're all still here. And there's power. Let's crank it up. Look at this. It goes all the way up. Up the mountain. There's another little building up the mountain here too, because why wouldn't there be? Check it out. So in that little building up here, what's this? United States Ski Association Gate Judge Card. Look at that. February 24th. Hey, my birthday. Look at that. 01. So that's when this place closed. Look at this. And this is just what's in here. It's just like a little office and uh, I guess this is where they judged some ski competitions. And uh, as you can see from the paperwork right there, there's still a computer here. A little heater. And still some paper. Pretty cool. Whoa, coming down the mountain. We're coming down the mountain. Okay. Hey guys, well, that was the resort. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. It was awesome walking around. I only thought it was gonna be a couple of buildings and it was so much more. So until next time, see you on the next adventure.